Hey everyone, I have a quick update for RPG Playground. So first of all, I implemented fading when you move between levels. Let me show you. So if you enter this house, then you see we first fade to black and then we enter the new level. Also, if we go upstairs here, you see fade to black. Now I didn't do this for when you stay in the same level, so if you go to the little room here, then you see I don't fade to black because I think it's kind of a weird effect in this case. So that is the first thing I implemented. The second thing is that our inventory now has coins or money or whatever you want to call it. So let me show you how that works. Let's add a pickup here. And let's change the item to a chest all right now if the hero picks up this item then we don't want it to be added to the inventory we just want a custom action so we can add an action here and that is the hero and then we go to inventory and in inventory now as you can see here we have money what can we do with this money? Well, we can increase it, decrease it, we can set it, or we can also do checks on it. So this is ideal for if you want to give the hero some money, or you can create a shop where the hero can buy something. So first you check, does he have more or equal the amount of money of the item? And if so, you can decrease it. So let's just, in this case, increase it to something. Just some number here, next, all right close it as you can see we still have zero and if we go to pick it up then we have the amount so it's basically that simple it's just an extra thing where the player can really see how much money he currently has and that's all i wanted to show you in this video like i told you it's a really small release but next time it will be a bigger one because i will add an equipment tab here and that will allow the player to equip certain items so you will have to stay tuned and expect that soon don't forget to subscribe to this channel of course like the video and have fun creating your games bye